All right, it's uh, Wednesday morning. Got Buddy in the car. Yeah, that's a good boy. And we're gonna go to the auto parts store and pick up the water pump and a thermostat. And this is all gonna be for Friday because we're gonna do a new battery. Um, well, hopefully I get my paycheck Friday. So when I do, um, we'll build it to install this. Um, I gotta get a new battery for this thing because uh, it's starting to die. I mean, it's not too bad. I mean, you can still use it. Let's see if it'll start. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's normal. But it's uh, starting to get kind of old because of the uh, all the jump starts I've done with this thing. So um, it's time to change it out with a red top battery. So um, yeah, we're gonna get the new battery. It's 200 freaking bucks, but it's gonna be pretty sweet. And then the water pump you see there is 32 dollars, and the thermostat's like five bucks. So. Um, but I got a little bit of cash, I can get the stupid uh, pump today. The only reason why I'm replacing that is because it's chirping, as I've mentioned before. And it's got 161,000 miles on it, so it's time to get a new one. Um, yeah, I'm going to have to get a uh, fan clutch uh, removal tool. That's going to be about 30 bucks. And if I really have to, I'll spend 50 or whatever for uh, the real deal. But yeah, enough chit chat, let's go get parts. So forty-one dollars and some odd cents. We later we have a brand new water pump. Well, remanufactured, but still brand new. At least to this car. And also inside, I threw the thermostat. It's a thirty-two dollar water pump. So uh, it comes with a gasket. I was a little worried about that. Thought I might have to buy another one. So. I'm gonna set that just over here real quick. Here are the instructions. I'll probably go through them and read them just in case. Thermostat. And a brand new pump. Oh yeah, nice and it's like turning in honey. Oh yeah, that's gonna be nice. Now there, I think there was a core on this, but it was like it was like uh, three bucks. I'm not even gonna, I'm not even gonna go back there. It's gonna. But three dollars will not cover the cost to go there, so I'm just gonna keep the old pump. See if maybe we can take it apart. Which I don't know how we're gonna do that. I don't know. Anyways, we got a new pump and new thermostat. Let's go over that. This is just the intro video. Hence the title. We're not actually replacing anything today yet. Because I have to, I want to get some coolant to refill the system. I'm not going to do a full flush. I'll pay for someone to do that later to do it properly. But here's the new thermostat. It's a tiny little thing compared to the one in, in an expedition. I'll be sure to wipe that down. I don't want to get uh, too many fingerprints on it. Um, the only reason why I'm getting this is because it's so cheap. Um, you might as well replace it while you're in there. So um, I know this is sometimes a cause for cooling problems. Not really, but 
you know, just gonna change it anyways. I'm, I'm double checking to make sure I make sure if I need to get a uh, special tool to take the the guy, the son of a bitch off here, the fan and uh, the clutch. And uh, basically, the tool I need is a uh, it's just a long, uh, basically a long wrench that's really skinny. Goes down in there, and you just uh, yank on it with a, a ratchet or whatever, and then she should come right off. And I think it's gonna be either right hand, or either clockwise or counterclockwise. We'll we'll figure that. Out. It might be. Uh, I'm thinking it's gonna be uh, counterclockwise. I don't know. We'll figure that out. But, uh, yeah, so there's that. Um, basically, the hoses that will get replaced is this guy here. I'll make sure we put some rags or something under there to catch any coolant. Um, and then the lower rad hose down there is going to get changed out. And then we'll get a new battery. This is what I got in there now. Oh yeah, this is uh, a low-end battery. Um, the the red top battery I'm gonna I'm gonna get has 800 cold cranking amps and a uh, thousand cranking amps at 32 Fahrenheit. So that's gonna be uh, pretty sweet. Let's look at the coolant. She's not too bad. It's I've seen worse, but uh, yeah, this is gonna be fun. Definitely gonna be fun. We'll definitely try out the new battery though when we get it. And then uh, later we're gonna get a bigger alternator. I'm gonna get a 130 amp. This is a 90 amp. Oh, I think I just shut my phone off. Uh, this car is supposed to have a, a 130 amp alternator unfortunately we got the uh, 90 amp I think the 90 amp is or 95 amp excuse me is uh, not enough for this rig because it has the all the controls and they had the air ride system and... oh god damn it. fog lights and yada 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 all that fancy shit oh so expensive, but it's gonna be awesome. So yeah, here are the specifications. Uh, yeah, this uh, this battery's gonna roll. Two hundred bucks. Yeah. Twelve dollar core, so I can get rid of mine. Don't have to deal with it. Actually, you know, I might just keep that and just give my old one to my cousin Adam because his Kia needs a new battery.